Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. As promised, let me talk about the, the dumbness of a burner. It's called Burner Burner Owner Group Two. A Burner Owner Two. I uh, basically it's, it's a uh, Facebook support group where people post things, all the burners or stuff like that <laughs> I uh I, I told them about the situation because this was an act, a active situation where I had to bring my burner um so I put it on there but the way how Facebook adds video it added me with my burner in my hand first and then add the kid second um so basically what happened was, if you look at it, you see me first going across, and then you saw some kids running, and they run into their car. Um, how it, it appeared, it appeared to me, how it appeared to me, these kids parked their car, and they knocked on my next door neighbor, door to the left and they knocked on my door and they ran and they thought it was funny um stupid because I have video recording of them and, and I have video recording of their car but anyway I posted this on the, the Facebook support group and I had all, most people, 70% was pretty supportive. Other people said, well, you legally in trouble. I said, how, I, I, I asked how I'm legally in trouble. And then they said, you know, you got to know your state laws and this. I clearly said in my, in my video that, I, I said in my video, hey, this is some kid. Some kids running from my property, and I had a weapon. Secondly, but everybody kept seeing the videos. They didn't take the time. They didn't take the time just to see that the transaction already happened, and then I just came outside with my burger just to make sure everything was okay. Um, and people said, "Well, they're just kids. You should have brought your burner out." You stupid, stupid people. I'm not gonna, I don't care you kids. I don't care you're a grown man. I don't care you're a female. I don't care you're an alien. I'm gonna have my weapon and if you stupid enough to come to my, to my, um, I saw a coyote, that's kinda cool. But if you stupid enough to come to my house, then you get what you deserve. Um, and then if I, if I, was out there with those kids out there. I had my burner. I'm pretty sure they would have ran anyway. I was. I, I, would, I would have drawn my burner out and said, hey, you're on my property. Get off. Hey, get off my property. You know, that that would have been the action I would have done if, if they were there. But anyway, people are so stupid, they don't even take the time enough to look at the videos and see the difference. They just look and just say, oh, okay, this happened. And I'm telling you, okay, it's not the it's not in the in the motion how I have it. Facebook put one video one and one video two. Um and it, it, it was reversed, but I told them it's it, it's not in the sequence that, that Facebook put put it online. Oh, so I had all I had people tell me this legal that this like I don't know what Castle Doctor is or I don't know what Stay Your Ground is. I don't know um, all these laws. I I, I I I watch the same posts and I read the same YouTube videos. In fact I dare to say if you're not a lawyer I have watched more legal firearm videos than anybody I know. I watch 
a lot of firearm videos because I want to make sure I'm in the legal right. Um, even though it's a burner, people don't know that. And this is the element that a lot of people don't like to say, but I'm going to say it. Me, with a black, me, me being a black man in a very white area with a weapon in my hand is, is, is not the look I want to go. Um, if you think, oh, that's a racial issue, you just go to NAGA, which is the uh, National African American Gun Association. Go to the end they post. You put that question in and you see their feedback. And that is a huge fear of a lot of black gun owners. But I digress. Um, some people just don't even take the time to just look, look. Read, look at the videos. Don't don't jump to conclusions. And look at the sequence. I'm not gonna go and shoot kids, but look at the sequence of the videos. Um, I mean, they could have left a bomb at, on my front porch. They could have left a baby. You know, I I didn't know. I just knew that my kids sleep there, and I'm gonna be the first line of defense. So, if anything legal happen, you know, let's go. I don't want to, but I'm not going to sit there. I'm not going to sit there and, and, and wait till you draw your weapons out. But luckily, the kids left. They ran. They did whatever they did. Um, and I, nothing happened. But if something did happen, and I'm gonna tell them to get off my property, and if they didn't move, I would, I would have shot them. Point blank. And if, if, if there's any type of aggression, they were coming forward, and I, after I tell them, please leave my property, please leave my property, please leave my property, I'm drawing out my weapon, drawing out my weapon, I, and, and they would not stop, I would have shot them. Just point blank. Just point blank. That that was I, what I was going to do. So, um, this could even be a legal video, whatever. I don't care. Blah blah blah. I just know that um, these support groups. I'm thinking twice about about being on those videos um, or, or 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 being on these support groups. Because a lot of these people are a little childish anyway um, in their thinking. So they they talk a lot of stuff about, oh, lethal, that's lethal, and oh, this is this. And then I present an opportunity where I had to bring it out. And then they were like, oh, you should not have brought out the less lethal. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not doing all this practicing and all this gunplay and all these videos. And if a situation arises, I'm not gonna call call to action. That's not who I am. If you that type of person, that's your business. But you come to my house at night and you bring in that, I'm, I'm going to do something about it. I do not depend on the cops to do anything for me. Uh, I, I, they, to me, they're pretty pointless. I accept when you accept when you need um, uh, documentation, or you know, or you can have a situation where a a crime is acting and you call. But in the moment, in 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 the situation, the moment they usually go be late, and the, in the situation already gone. So anyway, guys, this is kind of my long video. They mean to be, but you know. Um, be safe out there. Uh, do understand the laws of the land for your protection. Um, and until next time. All right, bye.